Hi, welcome back to my second trailer for Brian's Rompod. Just wanted to give you a heads up on a couple of special episodes that are coming up. I thought rather than me do the talking, I thought I'd invite some guests. We have two interviews with people who are at different stages of their running journey. The first interview is with a friend of mine, John, who has been running most of his life. However, recently he has been dogged with injury and this has hampered his running. We start at how he got into running, what has his been experienced at school and how he got back into running at a later life. Plus, what have been the benefits for him? Here is an excerpt of his interview. First sort of proper run, and it was probably only a mile, I think it was about a mile, and about two thirds of the way through it, I tripped, <laughs> I tripped over oh, a bit no. of rain raised pavement and scraped all the, like, the skin off my hand and then I got back and I was, I was actually sick <laughs> so oh no I, I was that unfit so um, oh, right. yeah that, about 10-ish years ago but bizarrely about a week later I thought actually I enjoyed that and it was you know what I found is that quite quickly um, you know I was able to you know get up to 5k pretty easily um, okay. and then about a year after that I did a half marathon um, I've never done a full marathon but I've done yeah, about four or five half marathons since and various other runs. So yeah, that's how I got into running. The second interview is with Olympic triathlete Stuart Hayes. He performed for Team GB at the London 2012 Olympics with the Brownlee brothers. Again, he tells us about how he got into the sport at an early age and why, what advice does he give to those taking up running. Plus, he tells us about an interesting hobby he has as a sideline. All this is coming up very soon, so please do subscribe so you don't miss an episode. Again, here is an excerpt of the interview. I, was, I remember swimming one length, and if I could swim one length, I could join the club. And I did my one length, and then that was it. They said, right, you can come in the mornings and the evenings. So I think I was around seven or eight, seven or eight years old, swimming twice a day, every day, for the for the next like 10 years. 